All right. This is a persuasive speech to inform you about the need for in additional energy options and the supporting infrastructure to go with that. Developing alternative energy is the key to increasing availability and utilization by the public. If we look at the recent rise in gas prices we've experienced, we've all felt this in our wallets, that would be something would be more or be less impactful on our wallets if we had alternative options for fuel sources. The necessity for that is becoming more apparent when we encounter inflated fuel prices like we are now. Recently had an infrastructure bill passed by legislators that will increase the number of charging stations across the nation. That will be one way to improve and motivate people to purchase vehicles with hybrid fuel options. Um, we have plenty of space for wind energy and solar energy we should be utilizing that and improving those options as well um, it, fossil fuel does play a large and important role in our society and the need for that will probably never go away we just need to have alternatives available so that we have that source available to us for a longer time without causing uh, without causing any problems for the industries or agencies that need to use fossil fuels more than other areas of the community may need them. Certain industries are very reliant on fossil fuels and it would be difficult to alternate. It would be difficult to alter how they operate and would be beneficial for them to continue using fossil fuels. However, the individuals driving around town could be charging their vehicles when they're parked to go shopping or inside at work or is an example of how having the alternatives would be beneficial. Here in Kansas, we also recently learned that there will be a factory built to manufacture the electric batteries, I'm sorry, the rechargeable batteries for electric cars. And if we had a better infrastructure here in our local areas, we would be able to promote and support that local business or employing local people and help it grow and improve as well to keep it around and improve our economy locally. Another big talking point on alternative energy is the environment. Uh, while I do agree that is a very important thing to consider, I know it's not everyone's concern and not everyone agrees on the state of our environment globally and climate change. Um, but there are other, other positive reasons to pursue alternative fuel sources, like previously mentioned making it easier on our wallets and our day-to-day -day lives if we have alternatives that don't cost almost five dollars a gallon. Our lawmakers have already taken steps in the right direction with the recent legislation passed and our local government here and ensuring the our contribution to improving alternative fuel options here with the a new factory being built. 
um, they've laid the groundwork and we need to make sure we let them know that we agree with what they've been doing in order to keep progressing into the future in a positive way. We need to let other representatives know that they need to also get on with improving our, our alternative fuel sources and ease of access to those sources. And to do that, you can easily find their phone numbers, emails, websites, even addresses for your district representatives if you go to www.openstates.org and let them know that we're heading in the right direction and we appreciate their efforts. But more importantly, let them know that we need more innovation and more continued support for our alternative energy sources.